everyone, and welcome aboard the Story Ship. I'm Sean Driscoll, your host and captain. We've got a great story for you today. It's crazy, and it's fast, so buckle your seatbelts and hang on. It's called the Roller Coaster, and it comes from C.J. Hicks Elementary in Conyers, Georgia. <laughs> It all started one Saturday afternoon. My fifth grade class went to Six Flags as a reward for earning the most airports in our school. As we entered the park, we were greeted by the delicious aromas coming from the food stands. The colorful plants lining the walkway and the screaming come from the famous roller coaster garage. The walkway was crowded and we were right to ride roller coasters. We were stunned when we saw the enormous Goliath. Goliath was red, orange, yellow with flames on the coaster cars. The wheels were gold and had spinners on them. The track looked like strands of DNA with its twists and turns that looped with confusion. Our excitement was building up more and more as we got closer to Goliath. As we got to the ride, some of us got scared when we saw the sign that said, Enter if you dare. We eagerly jumped into our car, pulled down our safety straps, and buckled them. Once everyone was buckled in, the ride started to move, and we were shaking with both fear and excitement. As we rounded the first loop, the coaster started to make clicking and popping noises. The track was shrieking. We were all scared as we entered the loop of fear. Suddenly, the car stopped, and everyone started screaming like howling monkeys as we hung upside down. The only thing holding us in was our safety strap. The blood rushed to our heads as we started screaming for help. Eventually, firemen brought an inflatable cushion to catch us. In their excitement, they pumped too much air into it and it popped before we were able to jump to safety. Moments later, a helicopter arrived with a bungee cord in a second attempt to save us. Because of its propellers whirling dangerously close to our heads, it couldn't get close enough to rescue us. I don't know why a stranger appeared with a ladder from the fire truck. As he climbed it, he noticed a crack in the track. He realized he had to move quickly because the roller coaster was about to fall. He jumped off the ladder just as the roller coaster fell and caught the car right before it hit the ground. He placed it down softly. Everyone cheered as the young hero saved the class. We thanked him for saving our lives and got his autograph. He left as the news crews came because he didn't want to be known. That was a day we will never forget. We learned to not panic because everything will be okay when you are calm. Whoa, that was crazy. Thank goodness for heroes. Guys, I want to invite you to visit us online at thestoryship.com. And if you or your school would like to be on the story ship, just drop us an email at mystoryatthestoryship.com. Also, visit us online, find out about our workshops for storytelling and podcast creation for schools and for our awesome shows and performances. Thanks, everybody, for listening. Have a great holiday.